Alright guys, uh, today um, I've got my Droid 3 and I want to show you a uh, newer ROM <coughs> that has just come out recently um, that is pretty fun. I'm enjoying it. Uh, basically what it is, is it is a cleaned up version of um, stock ROM for the Droid 3. So, uh, this is actually it. I'm going to actually show it to you and then I'm going to show you how to install it. So, we'll go into it. It's very, very stripped down. Um, and then some applications are even replaced with uh, stuff that has less, uh, uses less Motorola stuff. So, <clears throat> we do have DPS Manager, FM Radio, Mobile Calc Free, Quick Picks instead of your gallery. I love Quick Picks, it's excellent. I use it all the time. Um, you do have your quick office which comes with uh, the droid 3 in there, which is nice I like that I normally put it back in all the rounds that I flashed because I use it all the time um, Let's see what we got here Super user terminal. That's pretty much it. This is your apps right there. So it's not a lot He's taken a lot out of this to keep speed in it uh, So it's just really nice. It is fully functional and this is um, called min mini moto and this is a uh, V1.65 uh, so it's mini moto less is more and like I say it's a uh, stock ROM so um, let me just go into a couple things you do have some toggles up here on the top which are very nice um, go into settings here and these are your basic settings about phone and you can see here this is Android version uh, 2.3.4 actually if you can see that and it is the Verizon system version uh, dot 906 so um, there you go settings um, let me go into launcher settings which are blacked out so it'll be easier for you to see uh, and you can see you got general stuff here you got your desktop your grid sizes your transition effects you know that kind of good stuff I only have two transition effects this is uh, a hollow launcher um, so let's change see our transition effect now it's yeah you can kind of see it fading in and out as you go so there you go um, that's basically it it's very very uh, small um, zip file and it uh, gives you a lot of extra resources for RAM and stuff like that so your thing doesn't bog down and get too slow so very very nice little ROM so I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and show you guys how to install this um, first thing you're gonna have to do is make sure you have safe strap uh, 3.05 on on your phone which I already have installed that's how you install this um, and then you got to boot into safe strap I have videos on how to install safe strap on the droid 3 um, I'll try to put them in down in my video description down below and uh, let's go ahead and reboot this device so power off and power off and then we're going to power back on in safe strap and I'll show you how to flash this so that was a quick power off we're going to power back up you're going to see a uh, splash screen here let's see alright hit the menu button on the bottom this will get you into safe strap 3 alright so there you go we are now in uh, safe strap 3 here and uh, we're going to go ahead and go into ROM, our boot options right here. And right now, my mini moto is the ROM slot that is selected, which is ROM slot 3. You can see it up on the top up here. So, basically, to install this, you're going to activate a ROM slot. So, you can pick one. I have a couple of the ROMs already in this phone. So, we're going to just pick the one that's already here. It says it's currently activated. If it's not, I'll show you. Like here, you go in here and you hit activate. But this one is activated, so it is selected. Um... So if it's selected, then you're going to go to uh, wipes first, and you're going to wipe cache, Delvic, factory reset, and then you're going to go back, and you're going to go to installs, and you're going to pick your ROM, you got to find it in your file manager here. It is Minimoto V1.65 zip. Select it. Make sure it is listed up here, which it is. And then flash. So 
Um, really, really easy to do. It doesn't take long, like maybe a minute to flash this thing. And then we'll boot up and I'll just show you the boot animation. And that's pretty much it, guys. Like I said, this is based on Android version 2.3.4. And it's for the Droid 3. It's called uh, Mini Moto. Less is more. Strip down ROM. Uh, so you have manages your resources really, really well. So you have plenty of RAM to do whatever you want to do on here. And you don't get too much lag or freezing. Uh, please check it out. I'll put links to this in the video description. Um, to the XDA form and all the other goodies there. So you just go ahead and reboot like I just did. And you should be good to go. I'm going to just like I say, show the boot animation. And uh, that's it, guys. Um, thanks for watching this. I appreciate all the subscribers. I'm almost up to... 200,000 views on my channel almost 600 subscribers so I'm pretty excited about that for six months of YouTube um, so there you go there was a splash screen and boot animation boot animation is stock boot animation um, stock Android boot animation I should say so there isn't really too much to it it's just a Android thing that comes up here should come up here there it is Android that is it Plain old simple boot animation. So this thing is going to boot up, but uh, I'm going to let you guys go here. Uh, thanks for watching this, and we'll catch you guys next time.